so welcome guys i'm about to show you how to design this using photoshop so first of all you get your page your design page here i'm using i'm using the scale of 10 by 80 10 by 80 so you create so once you create you have your space that you work with so i have this picture already so once i import the picture i scaled it So after scaling that, we bring in this other picture. I want to use it as a background. So what I did here, you come here to and change the the layer to screen mode. So one is on screen. You reduce the opacity. So once they duplicate it, the other side, so you can see what we are having now. So you type in your text. You type in your text. So that's it, you type the text. So the gold part, I typed it. I typed it on Corel Drum. Then I exported each as what, as PNG. I exported them as PNG. So after exporting, I went to freepix.com. Once you go to freepix.com, you type 3D gold text, you see different kind of text there that you can use. You download any specific one that you want to use for your design. After downloading, you open in Photoshop. Make sure you download the PSD format, which you can edit. So you open in PSD. So you can see so after opening, you go to the part that says your design here at this very end. Double click there. It will open where you place that export you did from, from this Corel Draw. So you place it there, you can see. So anything you place here will take effect on that very page. So once I click close and save it, yes. So it goes, it takes me to that, it takes me to the this very page and apply the all the effects on that particular, on that particular drawing I did. You can see how it's been done now. You can see the curves and everything having that gold effect. So you get, so now I'm going back to my design bringing the the gold effect I did so you can see but you can see her skin is somehow gold her skin is somehow gold so I want to apply a dark shade below so I'll click the this layer then and apply a black shade so after applying that apply a gradient a gradient on it so you can see you can see the gradient I did so 
So you bring in the boss lady too. You bring in the boss lady text that you did also. So you bring it to the top layer. So you align it there. So once you align, you align it. So below it, you can see the angles here are clashing. You will not see the boss lady so clear. So I want to apply black brush there. So I'll add a layer underneath the 3D text. Then I pick my brush tool. Pick the brush tool. When I pick the brush tool, then I click on black. So I apply a black shade on that. So once you can see how it's coming up now, you can see. So guys, that's that's it. You brush, place the brush there. You can see the dark, the dark effect is taking place there. So what you do next, you type, I downloaded this, this symbol, the compact audio disc there. So you can see what I did there. So you find a position and place it there. So you type in, type in the artist name. And place it. Place it there. You can see how simple this looks. From there, if you want to get the, the icons I use, the social media handle stuff, there's this software. If you want to get it, go to my Instagram. you get the, the link to download it, these icons. Go to my Instagram handle. My link in my bio you get to download where you can get these icons you get them for free and use so if i want to use a yellow icon now for instance i change you see any icon i bring in, in the color yellow now so i'm using the white so i bring in the handles you can see can see it so that's how you can use this so go to my instagram jamaco 247 jamaco 247 you're going to see my handle you can download this link from my instagram the software is there on my instagram go and get it so you're going to place the icons So basically, you type the, the artist name, the handles them. As simple as that. Guys, you can see. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel, guys. Follow me on TikTok, on Instagram, and YouTube. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. On my TikTok. The link to my YouTube is on my bio there. So guys, you can see, basically, that's what we did here. So now I bring in this flare, so you can place the flare any position that may suit your own tastes. So, so guys, I think that's all.
for these tutorials so guys i'll see you next in another tutorial like share comment please like this video share it and comment thank you guys so most importantly is this 3d text that we just did i showed you you go to free pics browse and, and you get different styles you use them and achieve the 3d gold text here on photoshop thank you very much and see you next time on another tutorials.